City of Rocks. Ahead of us is the electric area. Over to the right is where the pavilion is. Also ahead, straight ahead, is the visitor center. I'm so glad you all are here. I love that this is a good blend of part-time, full-time, and time on the road. But the 10 a.m. announcement is where I'll go over any changes to the schedule, as well as we'll go over, does anybody have any wants or needs, and does anybody have anything that they can give to somebody that might need some help? So we kind of start matching up and doing different things at the 10 a.m. Um, announcements. So it's not just announcements, it's, it's a, that's where we really get to know each other. So let's go around so we can put faces with the names of the YouTube creators that are here. I'm Deborah Dickinson. <laughs> are you sure? I've been on YouTube since 2016, I'm just saying. Um, We're going to be yeah. Anybody at this table, YouTube? I don't have any content yet, but I'm going to be, be on the road. Be on the road. I love that. That's all right. We'll be on the lookout for it. Travels with Dottie. Dottie's the puppy. I'm Nomad X Tina. It's X T E N A because my name is Christina with an E. Pup Camper 58. Pup Camper 58. Yeah. And I have a small YouTube channel, but right. that's all. It right. documents my journeys. All right. We love it. Seat Up's Journey. See <laughs> Dub's journey. Um, yeah, I don't know how long I've been on there a little bit, but I got small tail. Come see me over here. Yeah. <laughs> um, Nelly, RV Adventures, Lucy and Brian. All right, wonderful. And you two. We're a gypsy pair. We're not real good YouTubers all the time. You can find us on Instagram and Facebook too. And we can try and TikTok a little bit. Yeah, they're awesomeness. And um, I don't know, Donna, do you oh. think you? <laughs> <laughs> That's Donna with Shalom on the Run. Yeah, you do. And Facebook, but I'm never on. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm uh, Sally Lawrence at Sally Fourth on YouTube, and I'm doing some Facebook and Instagram, but not that much. Awesomeness. Coming on around. Dave Dexter <laughs> on YouTube and also on Facebook. This is not a YouTube meetup. There happens to be a lot of creators here, but I think I can put that on the back of the schedule so some people in the Facebook group may have already seen it. But if you do not want to be on camera, because there are so many of us that like to take pictures and post, and even if it's just for our families or whatever, it's going to be up to you to stay out of the lens. Please don't go up to somebody and go, ah, you can't film me. That's up to you, and I hate to do that. But with so many of us here, I don't see any other way to do it, okay? Yeah. Can you knock off 100 pounds? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying! <laughs> around it and that's where our evening campfire will be at six our first one will be this evening morning fires that's on the schedule is there for dance night we are gathering propane and propane fire bowls and we have tarps that we can put up to block wind if we need to people can stay at the fire they can come here to the dance um so um it doesn't matter yeah i would say we're going to start the fire at six if people are getting antsy and want to come do dance and you hear music, come on over. How's that sound? Who's, who's, right. who's the DJ? <laughs> I got the request off of Facebook. Every one of your requests are in the playlist. And then Jana spent hours, and I mean hours, putting it into two different playlists for Tuesday night and Thursday night. So thank you, Jana. We'll see. Yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you. Last year, somebody realized that they had a, you guys, I cannot talk over you, Bob. I, we go back almost 30 years, so I, I have a little levity there. I cannot talk over you guys. I have a large Let's see, what we're 
was I? We'll talk about wants and needs. Wants and needs. Thank and you. The water leaks yes. And, and, and then last year, some people installed solar, and they realized they had an extra solar panel. And so, in the 10 a.m. announcement, they're like, "I have an extra solar panel. Does anybody want it?" So you never know what will come up, and that's just one of the things that we cover at 10 a.m. So if you lose something or if you find something, check at the office. But you can put it here. And any other notes like that? I lost ten thousand dollars. I did, but I spent it. Oh. In my trunk. I get and raffle items. Judy and Kat are collecting raffle items. They will put what you donated. And then they will either put anonymous or your name, whichever you want to go by. And we're going to have a cornhole competition. It will be over there in that flat area. And Dennis is, is and uh, C Dubs are hosting it. They will be coordinating that. Everybody gets a raffle ticket in your bag. So you start off with one, and you have a chance to get more for the treasure hunt. So um, let me go ahead and start passing out bags. Oh, yes. I just like to say you picked a really good spot for this place. I love this place. Oh, thank you. That's really good. It is. You don't ever get off the road or out of your campsite. It is awesome. But you guys, there if you get up in the rocks, it's magical. Now, Rob parked his bike and went up in the rocks and then had trouble coming and finding his bike again. But let me just tell you, do not... He did. I got lost. Yeah, yeah. But so, so if you're trying to find a specific destination, it could be a little difficult. But let me tell you, don't, don't let that stop you. Because it's just a center path of rocks. And all you have to do is go out to the main road at any given time. When I'm up through the night. I can't turn down the noise, say all the words out of my mind About who I'm supposed to be, I start to believe I can't get it right Remember the days I let slip away, they were simpler times Mama told me before you leave If there's only one thing you remember from me Child, when you're out on your own. There are rattlesnakes in the area. I have been coming here, um, this is my seventh year. I've never seen one. I've seen a snake. It was not a rattlesnake. We're not going to be able to. Y'all are my trouble group. You know what I do? Is it this? Is it this? Always that table. Always that table. That table. <laughs> Jana came in as security looks like. <laughs> GVN and friends site. This is Marty's site and uh, we're going to have a little Galvan Nation activity within Deborah's Meetup, the Cocoa Fest. What'd you make there, Don? I made a Wilma Flintstone choker. Oh, nice. Okay. Hi, Kathleen. How are you? <laughs> yes. Oh, very nice. That's excellent. <laughs> and who came up with this idea? Our fearless leader, Miss Marty. <laughs> Hi there. Hi. <laughs> I like the choker car. I like that. And you're just starting, right? Mm -hmm. All right. She's, she's the whole part. Yeah, it is almost perfect. A oh, wow. How can you do that? That's cute. <laughs> <laughs> it is adorable. That's cute. Yeah. Really? really cute. <laughs> I like that. Oh, which, by the way, guys, since we're talking about the Flintstones, I do have a video, recent video, yeah, out okay. about the Flintstones. Yes, I went to a Flintstone village. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> and you're out on your own A million miles from home Feeling the weight of the world On your shoulders Child, don't forget who you are Don't lose your head or your heart I'll bet my life on your stars You'll be dancing Dancing on the moon Hey, uh, Dutch oven liners Which is in aluminum 
and uh, not very expensive. Mm -hmm. So this was a square sheet mm -hmm. off this roll, and I cut it into to fit my Dutch oven. Mm -hmm. So the way you want to do that, a sheet way.
and it's awesome, and it doesn't use much power. It's just like the smallest rice cooker they make, basically. Oh, cool. This is called Quake Hold, but it's earthquake putty. Museums use it to hold things on shelves. I bought it actually for my diamond painting, but then I realized I have one of those canisters with pencils in it. Stuck that down, and the stuff does not move. So this is, this is awesome stuff, and it's, it's, it's just a white putty kind of stuff. A van, and so when I want to bake cupcakes, cookies, cakes, or whatever, this is my oven. I can also do fish, salmon, steak in here, cut to fit. And I bought this entire system with all the inserts because you can get these separate. It cost me maybe about $80 at the time. There are cheaper versions out there now. My only regret is I didn't get the thermostat, then I wouldn't have this cute mark. <laughs> What's the name of it? Amia. And it's an oven? It's an oven. And you can bake biscuits and all kinds of but stuff. You can put it on top of the stove. It goes yeah. on top of the stove, on top of your gas burner, or if you've got an electric eye. What happens is the bottom traps the air, and then it heats the rest of it up. This lid keeps it capped, but yeah. No, that's awesome. Which I don't have, so I think I'm going to get one of them. But there, there are cheaper versions out there. I think that is really great. Yeah. <laughs> My gadget is so little. <laughs> But you stamp it on the side of a pot, and it keeps the pot from closing all the way. It'll let the air through. Right. I like oh, that. What is it? it? You put it between a, like the lid and the bottom, and it lets the air come in here. It clamps onto the pot, and it lets the air come on. That's handy. Oh, so. Awesome. OK, this is my gadget. It is just like a mini garden sprayer. And, of course, it does all the things you'd expect. Like, you can wash your hands, take a shower, uh, you know, hold it up like this, take a shower, uh, rinse out your toothbrush. I mean, you know, all that good stuff. And I, I just love it. It's my night light if I have to get up in the dark. Um, and then it has a bright light. I read by, and then a brighter light. And it was only like... Less than five dollars, and I think you can find these at Walmart. Yeah. This is the light people right here. Because I'm, the light right here. <laughs> I'm gonna get on here yet. This is a, huh? It's okay. Go ahead. This is a magnetic light, and it comes with a piece that you attach to the ceiling, and so it's magnetic. Um, it has different strengths. You get really bright. Oh. Or it can get really dim. I like that. And then you can also different types of lights. And we bought, because Deborah bought some of these after I bought some, but then I also bought extra magnets. So I just moved this light wherever. I take it into the bathroom, put it on that magnet, have one over my bed so I can read. But, and it's rechargeable USB. I like that. Yeah, oh, I love really? them. I have two in so, there. So how much? I have four magnets, one over my kitchen table, one in the uh, bathroom, one over the kitchen sink, and one over my bed. Say the name of it. Alpha Home. Alpha yes. Home. Cool. Thank you. Spade. Spade it. <laughs> Break the ground open and wait to do this. This is for when you are deep wound docking and you need to build the, a cat hole with your Okay. Cats. <laughs> Your gray water and she has a cat, so she has to I have a cat, cat stuff. <laughs> so everything just works out. But you need both of these things. Deborah actually turned me on to this last year. Uh, well, actually, this summer. Mm -hmm. And uh, I found this at Walmart, and I don't remember the price of it. And I want to say probably around $20. Would yeah. be a guess. It's really good to do these. These are you can buy these dog a dozen, but they help. And uh, I recommend all of you guys that think about doing something, please do that. Find out the requirements for how deep your hole needs to be. Deborah can probably show you how deep that should be. Um, and make sure you do that and cover it up before you leave the campsite. And I'll just tell you the top of whatever you have buried, the top should be six to eight inches below the top of the ground. And then you put dirt back on top of that. Don't dig six to eight inches and think that's it. It needs to be six to eight inches above whatever you buried. I knew you'd say that better than I was going to. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh,
Get back in there. Nomads, does it take? How many was that? Okay, five to fold and one to fill. <laughs> yeah, probably so. Maybe my compass was wrong. And I'm still on my way closer each day to where I belong. I'm still rolling the dice, praying sometimes. I don't last the long. I'm losing my faith. I'm walking away from what you knew all along. Mama told me before you leave, if there's only one thing you remember from me. Child, when you're out on your own A million miles from home Feeling the weight of the world on your shoulders Child, don't forget who you are Don't lose your head or your heart I'll bet my life on your stars You'll be dancing, dancing on the moon